Today in this video, I'm just showing you like how you can create the email subscription from absolutely free. Okay. And this is the demo and let me show you some thing about like what we just create in there. So if I reload this page, then you will see the pop up. Okay. So this is the pop up and if you want to create any kind of more pop up or if you not like this pop up here, some uh, another pop up are available. Let me show you here. The one pop up here, another one. Here down. If you want to see the pro preview, then you will see. Just click on the preview, then you will see the demo. So this is the another pop up. To create like same type of pop up, you just need to install another plugin. Just hover on plugin and click on add new, and here search on here like pop up, and you just need to install this pop up like. Hustle like this email marketing online donation opt in pop up. Alright, so I successfully activated this plugin, and here as you can see, I got another option like Hustle. Like you just need to click on there, okay? And this is the dashboard, and uh, here showing like hey, so let's click on get the start button. And we just want to create like only pop up, so let's select pop up and click on create. And this is not a full. Uh, like this plugin review this is only for pop-up review okay only for a specific option so let's close this because we don't want to get like an pro version so here the pop-up we are get something like this and let's click on create option and then you just need to add the pop-up name let's add test so here as you can see two options like email opt-in and international email opt-in means you know I recently I show you then a pop-up this is called email opt-in and then the international is international means something like suppose in a person visiting your blog or your store then they will see an app 10 percent coupon with like call to action button something like this so let's click on email opt-in pop-up and i just select here okay so now as you can see here some pre-built uh, template which is provided uh, from this plugin and you just need to choose which you personally like so suppose i like this one so let's click on choose template button if you want to see the preview just click on preview button then you will see the preview so now as you can see i got some option here okay, the content email integration and appearance visibility and behavior the content option means you your like form content as you can see the title and also here images if you want to change the images and also here like main content everything are there and also if you want to do like if you want to add like call to action button you can add and here sir no th no thanks i'm not interested something like this so let's go to the email option and here only we are collecting emails that's why it's showing email and here the submit option and also here some takes thank you for when someone submit the email then they will see and here the automated email so if you want to set up automated email then you can do suppose uh, they just submit the email then you just need to uh, you just need to back an email like thank you for joining all newsletter something like if you want to do that you can on this so i'm not doing anything else here the integration means uh you know this plugin now working as like collecting email and uh, showing it into your server or here if you see email list all email are collecting and showing like email list but if you want to do something like uh you just need to collecting all email address and you just want to uh, like uh, stay in only mail chip okay or get response you just need to upload in there and then when you need it then you will use it so if you want to connect that you can you can connect from there here the integration option just click on there then you'll see the lots of companies are there like mail chip and uh, here convert kit e-newsletter get response all are available okay so whatever you like you can collect add here okay so let's go to the next option is appearance so this is the some design the desktop design this desktop will be seeing seeing like something like this and this is the some design and here the mobile option so nothing here <laughs> mobile and also the feature image and optim form so feature demos how will be show or here stream the element so i'm not doing anything else here and here the font family I'm not changing anything else here so let's go to this visibility this is the most important thing because of like um, if you not set up any kind of visibility then this pop-up will be horribly show like suppose if uh, if someone go to like your home page then they will see this pop-up and also if you go to the blog page they also like, show this page I mean everywhere every single page every single click 
he will see this pop up so this is so much boring and disgusting and that's why we just need to set up and rules okay so to set up rules it's very simple just click on add condition and then you'll see why you just want to show this pop up suppose i just want to show only for pages only pages so then i just select pages and click on add condition and uh, here like all pages or only these pages so if you want to select a specific page then you just select here like a home page you can select select this choose here because in in my website now nothing <laughs> nothing have so that's why I, I it's not showing much more but uh, in your website you will see lots of thing and uh, if you want to target any kind of a specific page or a specific blog or a specific thing then you can do okay so here if you want you can add more condition okay so i hope you understand about like uh, the visibility and the behavior if you see the behavior then you'll see like time a uh, pop-up trigger when this pop-up will be show so let me set up a scroll when someone scroll 40 percent then they will see this pop-up okay and if you want to do an, any kind of animation then you can you can add pop-up execution bounce out bounce in bounce out and let's page scrolling not okay so it's disabled so let's click on publish button it's not publishing okay so let's go to a website and let's see how it's looking now my website is now totally blank that's why <laughs> you not see anything let's go to this next page oh my god we just we just set up any rules so that's why we're not seeing anything here okay so this is the blank page that's why we're not seeing it okay, let's click on preview okay so okay so i hope you understand let's click on cross okay so it's gone let's click on mobile then it will be also present in there okay so i hope guys you understand and you get some idea uh, about like this plugin and if you want to learn more so then i think i recommend you just search about like this plugin name in google then you will get more videos about that okay thanks thank you